Mendocino, well, she's come through very, very well here to record her second career win. And really impressive that she's done it off the break. And Ellen did say she's working well, but had no gallops coming into this. So she, she's won decently. Yeah, she's won a nice race. Nice to see her come back in such good form, Nadine. Um, you know, albeit she was hanging towards the death. You know, once yes. I hit the front, she was really looking to get to the inside. Uh, hopefully that doesn't mean that there's something amiss, but she really had a lot in hand. And uh, she's won like the filly, I remember. Um, she showed us a lot of promise early on. And, uh, you know, she ran behind some decent sorts shortly after her maiden and then was obviously off the track for quite some yeah. time. I'm not quite sure why. I'm sure Ellen might be able to allude to that. But uh, a very, very encouraging return. And it's quite amazing that uh, you guys are actually getting reacquainted just short of a year. Correct. As I yeah. say, you know, she's been off the track a long oh, time. Wow. Yeah, she did have a few runs after I won or after her maiden win. But uh, at the same time, you know, she did give me a good feel back then. And, uh, you know, she still got it. Uh, it's just a matter of keeping yes. her ticking over now. So well done to Lee and Chelsea Scribanti. I know they got quite a few in training, but, yeah. you know, it's worth the wait for some of these and hopefully we can keep her going. Fingers crossed. Well done. Thank you. Alan making his way up to have a chat about Mendo Chino. Been off for a while, and Alan did say working very well, but you can never be 100% sure when you haven't galloped them into a race. Yeah, no, it's, um, you know, she hadn't got gallop, and uh, I was really happy with her work, so I'm glad she brought her work to the races. And uh, one last race, well done to Greg, to, um, to Mr. Chelsea and Lee Scrabanti on their win, and uh, yeah, I'm very pleased, you know. Well, I'm sure you are. I know you did rate her earlier in the career when she started off very well. She actually beat the East Cape Phillies Nursery winner, but unfortunately in the Phillies Nursery itself, things didn't go to plan. So let's hope she's on the up again. Yeah, you know, and the nice thing is uh, I know we raced her, a little, uh, I think, four times as a juvenile. Yeah. And then, you know, she, I thought I was hoping to get a bit of black type for her, but she just wasn't strong enough. Yes. And uh, I put her away and... Uh, you know, then one thing led to another that we just couldn't find so after giving her a break, the right races. Right. And, yeah. and then, she, you know, she got a little bit sick and you know, things just didn't work out. So luckily for us, uh, both uh, Mr. Chelsea and Lee are very patient people and uh, patience paid off. Well done, guys. It certainly did. Well done, Alan. Thank you, Nadine. There you go, Mendo Chino. Well, we've heard the background on her, of her. Unfortunately, things haven't all gone to come together for it's taken a while for her but today has been her day she's in the winner's box and very well done to mr chelsea and lisa Cavante. you've been patient she's paid you back race five now all clear three